Hi, my name is Sean Toothman. Come and see me. I'm at Phoenix Auto Parts here in Phoenix, Oregon. Uh, give us a call at 541-535-8300. Old lady from Pasadena. Hi, I'm Bill Kiefer, and I have a classic 1989 Ford Mustang, red, red, red. And I only trust Sean at CarQuest Auto Parts in Phoenix to get my parts. Be there or be square. Disc brake pads consist of friction material bonded onto a steel backing plate. The backing plate has lugs that locate the pad in the correct position in relation to the disc. Calipers are usually designed so that the condition of the pads can be checked easily once the wheel has been removed and to allow the pads to be replaced with a minimum of disassembly. Some pads have a groove cut into the friction surface. The depth of this groove is set, so when it can no longer be seen, the pad should be replaced. Some pads have a wire in the friction material at the minimum wear thickness. When the pad wears to this minimum thickness, the wire touches the disc as the brakes are applied. A warning light then tells the driver the disc pads are due for replacement. The composition of the friction material affects brake operation. Materials which provide good braking with low pedal pressures tend to lose efficiency when they get hot. This means the stopping distance will be increased. Materials which maintain a stable friction coefficient over a wide temperature range generally require higher pedal pressures to provide efficient braking. Hi, I'm Bill Kiefer, Bill Kiefer Video Productions for Southern Oregon. If you have a need, we start at just $300. Until next time, give me a call at 541-973-0906. Life's a foolish game, do you ever feel the same? Well, maybe we could change, turn the ship another way. Feel it in the darkness. Sailing right into those jagged cliffs Yeah Some say we've always been insane Hey, life's a foolish game Life's a foolish game